During the height of Wednesday's blackout, fire crews had to free people trapped in elevators. The idea of playing elevator roulette may sound funny, but try living with it. Come on, come on. Come on. My baby. Put yourself in the middle of California during the summer of 2000 when blackouts began to roll across the state. Sacramento, San Francisco, Beverly Hills, Long Beach, San Diego. The energy crisis would cost California $40 billion. For the second day in a row, not enough electricity for America's largest state and the world's sixth largest economy. I, I, I can feel for him. I was out of power four times this weekend for a total of over 10 hours. There simply wasn't enough electricity available. As the blackouts continued, there were competing narratives presented by the media. One such narrative was, this is just an unusual heat wave. Generating capacity is going to catch up. Today we know there was much more to it than that. The first thing we heard about this energy crisis is where our lights are going to go off in the middle of winter when we're using half the electricity we normally use during the summer. We have an installed capacity in California at the time of 45,000 megawatts, plenty of power. We only need 28,000 to 30,000 megawatts in December. Of course, we had blackouts in December. The numbers just didn't add up. We had enough power in California. It was never about lack of supply. You know, talking about OPEC puts me in mind of a simpler time when the energy interests we were held hostage to were American ones. And given the complexity and dryness of the subject, it seemed impossible the charges could ever be proven unless somehow somebody turned up some sort of smoking gun. Which brings us to last week. Hey, John. It's Tim. The regulatory is all in a big concern about is we're wheeling power out of California. Two Enron traders discuss a colleagal manipulation of the California power market. He just f***ed California. He steals money from California to the tune of about a million. Can we rephrase that? Okay, he, um, he, he arbitrages the California market to the tune of a million bucks or two a day. <laughs> um, Those greedy mother arbitragers. 